Hey guys, Dan up here. Here's another video about trailer life living. This one's about propane. It got burr cold here for a while, uh, probably about a month, and it didn't come above freezing that entire time. We used a lot of propane, and we didn't realize that we were out of propane until it ran out. Uh, this trailer came with this little switch here that you can switch it on your own from one side to the other or when one tank is empty the other one will automatically kick on so you don't you know have a stop in propane I guess usage well we didn't realize that we were empty on both tanks until about three o'clock in the morning when the propane stopped and it got really cold inside the trailer so we had to turn on the electric heaters which we really don't like to do so to stop that from happening I started turning one of them off completely and when the propane ran out I would come out and turn on the other one then fill up the first tank which is why this one's disconnected and I just got that one filled up. While I was at the RV place where I get this stuff filled up because they have the best prices for propane really I got two of these little gauge things and here's who they are. RV Supply Specialist Repair in uh, West Richland, which is, I don't know, it's kind of close to where I live, but it's on the way to the post office, so what are you going to do? Anyway, I got two of these, so we're going to put one on each of these, so we know exactly how much pressure is on there. So this all seems pretty slot A hole B, so let's try it out. I'm going to put this gauge on here. it on nice and tight and then we will stick the hose right here oh we might run into a problem with that interesting because the cover has to come down here and I don't want it to bend this wire so we are going to loosen this up Right here. Give this a bit of a turn. Something like that maybe. Hopefully that'll work. Okay, and back to it. Screw this on. sure they're both tight. Okay, now let's kick this on and see how much pressure we have. Very cool. Okay, so now let's try the other tank. Let's turn that off. So we turn this one off. We put this on nice and tight. And we will stick our hose on. Have to loosen this back up a little bit more. There we go. That's on. That's on. And I'll show you guys what happens when we turn this on. Okay, so we're going to turn on the gas and it will go up and say how much we have left. So this is done on a percentage and it has cold days, which it is, cool days right there and warm days or hot days. And so when it gets down into like down here, then we can swap over to the other tank and get this one filled. Okay, so there we have it. Both of the tanks with their gauges on it. And we're showing good pressure on both of them, no matter which way we switch this. Put it back to where it was. Okay, so let's put the lid on and hope it fits. Well, with the hoses in the way and those gauges, 
it pushed uh, the front of the cover here all the way to the back of the jack but you can see we can see over there that gauge and here we can see this gauge and we can always tell when we are out of propane or not well that's all i have for this video as always don't forget to comment rate subscribe check us out on the website and we'll see you guys on the next one <laughs>